In this clip I'll actually be doing a titration. Now I have transferred two aliquots of hydrochloric acid to my two flasks. I must put the indicator, three drops of indicator, into each of those. Reading the burette, I use a burette reading card to help me to get a better view of the bottom of my meniscus. So we're looking for the point where the very bottom of the meniscus curve is against your graduations. Remember we read from the top down, so it goes 2 down to 50. So hold this up and read your burette to two decimal places. Now in this case I'm reading 2.31. Before I start my titration, I must remove the waste beaker, make sure I don't have a drop hanging on the tip there, and place my burette or flask underneath the tap. Now, the tip of the burette should be inside the neck of the flask. Now, the correct procedure using your burette is your left hand wraps around your tap, while your right hand swirls the flask as the acid is run in. And swirling the flask gently to mix the contents. You'll notice as the base is running in that you'll get localised pink colour around the drops where it's going in but as you swirl that mixes and the colour fades. We want to keep titrating until semi-permanent pink that will last for 10 seconds. So you can control the rate of flow from your burette tap at the moment I'm just going drop by drop, but at this stage I will continue to do that. As you continue to run the base in you'll see that the pink colour starts to persist for longer. So at this stage we can afford to use a bit of deionised water, rinse off the tip of the burette and rinse down the walls of the flask. Now I need to go slowly getting very close now again rinse off that tip this will take up 10 goes Whoop. Very close, rinse again, that has faded, needs to last a little bit longer than that. Now at this stage we can actually get a tiny drop to hang on the tip of the burette and wash that in. There you have a good end point. At this stage, I think I've reached the end point. I'm going to take a reading of my burette again. Make sure the eyes are level. And this time I have 19.64. If you're not sure that you've reached that end point, again, little rinse, it's just water. Add another tiny bit. This, this pink is persisting very nicely, but probably a little bit too long. So you're probably past your end point. If you continue to add base, this is what happens. If you get to that colour, you have gone way past the end point and your results will not be accurate. 